when she takes the job as a governess, she's completely unexperienced. She's never worked as a governess before, and so she comes there with, you know, lots of worries, but also lots of hope and expectations. You know, I, I work predominantly and for a long time in theatre, and I approach all these pieces as, and this one lends itself to it hugely, to, as a theatre piece, and one explores the psychological development and the relationships of, of the characters, and to begin with, that one unpacks that, and then after a time, you know, the, the, the structure of the piece takes over, but embedded within that, I hope, are the, is, the, is the psychological development of the, of the characters. At the beginning of the opera, when she travels to Bly, is a very distinct because uh, there you can feel both her eagerness uh, to do actually some kind of success in in her new work, and at this at the same time uh, a desperate fear, what all can go wrong, and that ambiguity is very present in Mia's doing. I think she is able to create a, a figure which you both love immensely and at the same time which you feel detached from. To start with everything just seems to be fantastic, perfect. And then everything starts happening. She starts seeing things in the children which might be a little bit odd. And then of course she starts seeing the ghosts. I think the important thing for her is that, she, for, for the governess, is that she is an innocent as well. And her innocence is corrupted and she's not in charge of her emotional life. She's unaware of her over-involvement in these two children. She pushes Miles so hard and so far, she's thinking that she's actually doing the right thing. That you know, this is the only way to, to make the ghosts go away. So this journey from the person which you feel sympathy with or, or you like to a person, at least uh, for me it is like that, to the person uh, to who you can feel pity, but uh, in a way you think that she, by what she did, deserved a bit of the outcome. Peter, quit! You devil! For me as an actor and singer, it, it's, it's a horrible, horrible scene, very painful. Speak to me, speak to me. Finding that kind of, well, for her fragility, I think, was, was the, it's the journey that we, we were sort of interested in exploring.